Welcome back to Mathwino. We're given that 12 to the power m is equal to 18. So the value of 2 to the power 2m minus 1 over m minus 2. How can I solve it? For dealing with this question, I have a really wonderful way. Before solving it, pay attention to this exponent. The exponent is a little complicated. But here, the exponent is quite easy. It's just an m. But here, it's a fraction of m. It's a term. Now, 12 and 18. I'm going to define the factors of them. 12, it can be written as 2 times 2 times 3. And to the power m. 18, it is 2 times 3, then times 3. So now, from the formula, a times b, all to the power m, is equal to a to the power m, then times b to the power m. From this, this equation is 2 to the power m times 2 to the power m, then times 3 to the power m. What's on the right, what's on the right hand side? Just 2 then times 3, then times 3. Okay, maybe you've noticed that. 2 to the power m, then times 2 to the power m. They are same. I can write it as 2 to the power... Now I'm going to use another formula. a to the power m, then times b to the power n. It is equal to... Oh, sorry. Here is a. Uh, it's not b. I think my brain yeah, is old. a to the power m, then times a to the power n. If here is b, uh, then there's no formula about it. to the power m, then times a to the power n. So it is a to the power m plus n. In this equation, a is 2. And m and n, what's m? It is here, m. What's n? It is here, another m. So in this case, m and n, they have the same value, m. So m plus m is 2m. That is 2 to the power 2m. And then times 3 to the power m. And it is equal to 2 times, you see here, 3 times 3, don't write it as 9. We should write it as 3 to the power 2. Awesome. And then you can see. These two, they have, their bases have the same value. And these two terms, they have the same base. So now, it can be turned into... A 2 to the power 2m divided by 2 is equal to 3 squared and then divided by 3 to the power m. So from this, I use this formula. a to the power m divided by a to the power n, it is equal to a to the power m minus n. Wonderful. Now, what's on the left hand side? It is 2 to the power. This, I can regard it as 1. So it is 2m, then minus 1. So the exponent is this. And what's on the right hand side? It is 3 to the power 2 minus m. You see that? What we'll got the value of this? What's on the exponent? On the numerator is 2m minus 1. 2m minus 1. But here is 2 minus m. They're quite similar. Because I want to get this exponent, not this or this. And the base is 2. Here the base is 2. So I can do this. I can 
get a power that m minus 2, 1 over minus 2. So I can get this power. Then it is equal to what's on the right hand side is 3 to the power 2 minus m, and then to the power 1 over m minus 2. So here we also use a formula, but I think there, there isn't any place to write it. I will tell you. a to the power b, and then all to the power c. It is equal to a to the power b times c. So here, 3 is a. 2 minus m is b. And 1 over m minus 2 is c. So now, I just get the multiplication of this. 2 minus m and 1 over m minus 2. So the multiplication of them is the new power, and the base is 3. So the multiplication of 2 minus m and 1 over m minus 2, that is minus 1. And what's on the left hand side? According to the formula, so that is 2 to the power 2m minus 1 the over m minus 2. So this is this. The final answer is the right hand side. So it is. 3 to the power minus 1, that is 1 third. Did you get it?